Colts are 346 and a half at home against Jacksonville. Jacksonville's played seven unders in a row at Indy. They're one and six ATS before playing Pittsburgh. Next three games at home for the Colts. See if they can get back to 500. Oh, boy. Can you bet on Bortles right now? As bad as he's been. 31st in passer rating. Colts are 25th in uh, points allowed as well. They're playing. They're actually been all right here. I know they had the close call against the, the Raiders. But you just you get Fournette back finally with Jacksonville. That can help. But you see how bad Bortles is playing, and it affects the rest of that team, and it, it's demoralizing for the defense, Teddy, that game after game they have to defend the short field. Sure. I mean, look at the scores. You know, they lose 30 to 14, 40 to 7, 20 to 7, 24 to 18, their last four ball games. You know, um, all of them. The offense didn't work. The defense didn't work. I guess they played their best game of the bunch against the Eagles at Wembley. And even that game, you know, rallying from behind, trying to get it together. The Jags are number yeah. 30 in turnover margin this year. Even if Fournette is back, okay, even if Carlos Hyde has an impact this week, it's still luck versus Bortles, advantage Indy. But, <laughs> and Fournette's not, uh, hasn't been 100% cleared. Uh, I, they do think he's going to play. He's been in practice uh, all week, but it's not a done deal right now. But. You talk about the Jags off those four losses, and Indy went into the bye off two blowout wins. Now, when you say, oh, that blowout wins, well, what'd they do? Well, let's see. They lost to the Jets, and they beat the Bills, and they beat the Raiders. So we're not talking about a team that's been dealing with quality foes. The Jags have been losing to quality foes. Indy's been beating on the week. This is a season definer for both squads. You know what I mean? It really is. The winner here live. The loser here, bye bye And if it's Jacksonville, the loser here, who knows what will happen. <laughs> I mean, uh, that team, that yeah. locker room could implode. Uh, but the one thing that has been very beneficial for Indy during this two-game winning streak, and even in the loss of the Jets, Marlon Mack running the football. We talk about Fournette. He's got the hype. Marlon Mack, back-to-back 100-yard games. The first time Indy's had that in like a decade. And we talk about luck. And luck, it's going to be the Jags' run defense that has to take care of business. They're not going to win unless they can make the Colts one-dimensional. Like the show? Help us keep the lights on. Please make sure to comment, share, and subscribe to all the Sportsbook Review videos. Thanks so much. Best of luck. Enjoy the games.